does it really well. So, uh, there you go. So, it's been a great start. Yeah, if the, the, the idea with heckling is to try and be funnier than the person on stage. At the moment, I, I, I've set the bar very low so far. And, uh, so, if, if, you've got something that, if you've got something funny to say, join in. If you haven't got anything funny to say, I had to tell you the date earlier on, mate, as you were writing in your book. You didn't know what day it was, so I think it's unlikely you're going to be that funny. That's just, that's just my guess. But if you are going to heckle, try and wait for there to be a gap where I'm not speaking so people can hear what you're saying. Because the thing is, I've got a microphone here, don't even spot it, whereas people can't hear you. Cause... So if you're going to come and heckle, at least prepare. Don't get so pissed you can't think. And that's the first rule of heckle. Second rule of heckling, maybe bring your own amplification system of some kind. But you are quite loud. So, um... I said, I know it hasn't gone very well tonight. Remember the rule about not speaking when the microphone's on because I can't hear you? Try and wait for a gap. There was one, you missed it. There was another one, again, you had a very big, I left a big gap. No, still nothing. I'll count you down to the gap, see if you can get into this time. Three, two, one. No, nothing. So, um...